Luke, thanks for your time. Was that a bit of a get out of jail at the end? Uh, yeah, I think so. But I, f I also feel like we, we could have had the, the game wrapped up in, in the first half, really. Um, but yeah, in, in the end, of course, we had, to, we had to come back from deficit. So we take the point. What do you make of the performance as a whole? Uh, so much of it I loved the performance, um, but the opposition made it very, very difficult. Let's be clear, they, they were fantastic. They, they're well prepared and they spent so much energy pressing us. They were fantastic and we, we really struggled with that. But then I thought we got to grips with the game and I think we had enough opportunities to, to score first and second probably. Um, but then I think the response at the end of the game um, to try desperately, desperately to get back on terms and then to try to win the game was, was excellent. I'm really pleased with that. Were you concerned at all with how effective the press was and how it panicked your players at times? Yeah, um, like I said, they done fantastic and um, they, they kept pressing non-stop relentlessly, but we carved out so many opportunities. So, yeah, OK, they, okay, they pressed well and they made it difficult, but not difficult enough for us to, to play through them, not difficult enough for us to create chances, but we need to take them when, when they present themselves some very, very good chances. But full credit, yeah, like I said, they, they made it very, very difficult. They pressed relentlessly, lots of energy, very well organised. Um, but like I said, we've we done enough. How do you ensure that that isn't the, the thing that other, other coaching staffs around the league don't look at and go, well, we'll just do that against Knotts as well? Yeah, OK, we can just kick the ball the length of the pitch every time we, every time we take it. But it's, uh, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen because we need to, find, we need to find the confidence and the quality to play against every opposition and the answer is not to to be so weak that we say oh you know we're, we're unbeaten and uh, yeah we had some difficult moments but we should have we should have I, I believe we should have won the game we should have we should win the game the weekend so no we need to we need to improve uh, and keep practicing what we do because uh, to be so weak to, to say oh we, we just rip up what we're doing and, and play so safe and uh, clear the ball at every opportunity is not is not going to be. No, I, I don't. That's not what I'm suggesting. But I just if you're not going to just knock it long. But how how do you get them doing what they're doing better so that people don't just go well we'll just press them and panic them into errors which they'll inevitably make. Yeah, we we need to practice uh, and we need to 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 keep uh, improving how we play. Um, it's nice to it's nice to be able to watch a team and and just to press them. Um, but we, we are a big club and we have to we have to, to play with courage and we have to we have to improve that and we have to then take our opportunities when they present themselves. Kyle Cameron's a big strong lad and um, he'll shake it off I'm sure, but how is he after the error for the goal? Yeah, we, it's a it's a team a team game and uh, um, we we have many opportunities to score uh, and then we're not under pressure like that at the back. Um, Cammy is playing in a different position tonight and so it can be adjusting to that a little bit but yeah of course it's a mistake but uh, yeah he, 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 he's, he's so strong he gonna, he's going to come back from that and you saw him in the game he didn't shy away from, from uh, his responsibility and, and continued to play very well for me. We saw Kedwin Scott replace uh, Macaulay Langstaff. At what point do you see that him being fit enough to, to come into the, the starting eleven and, and perhaps the two of them play together? Yeah, sooner rather than later, but he is struggling to get up to speed and the, the worst thing for me would be for him to break down and so I need to make sure that he's, he's really ready to play. Um, but he, he, to, that, to, to get him on the pitch was, was really important and uh, some of his, you can see some of the actions, he has so much quality. Do you think Aidan Baldwin will be able to, sore Achilles I think I heard you mention after um, the, the Boreham Wood game, do you think he'll be available for the weekend? I hope so, we have to assess him again when we get back to Meadow Lane but I hope so yeah. Still identifying and working on targets, new signings? Yeah yeah of course but like I said that we need to make sure that anyone coming in is, is He's of top quality for, for the level, the best that we can achieve. Um, because the guys are working so hard, but yeah, if, if someone's coming in, they have to be able to, 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 to show that they're, they're, they're top class. Appreciate it.